So I'd seen this drain from a car and wanted to come down and have an explore. So I jumped on Google Maps and had a quick look and saw that it ended in a tunnel. So I thought it could be a fun mission to go and have an explore. Riding along the storm drain, I'm riding along a walking path here. I think that might be the bit where the biggest problem comes from if people are walking along there. Already saw a couple of people that looked at me suspiciously. But coming up to the actual tunnel where no one will be able to see anything. The highway is just up there. Okay, so there's a bit more water than I expected under here. But looking up into the tunnel a bit, which you probably can't see on camera yet, it actually looks like there's more than enough space to ride along. So I'm gonna head in there with some lights on my bike and see what happens. Kind of cool you can hear the noise from the highway but it's also at the same time really quite quiet i can see up ahead a few hundred meters is the light for where the tunnel ends which you probably can't see on camera at all yeah you can just see a pinprick there so i'll head towards that and see what else i can see Right, we're through the tunnel. That was kind of cool, but I kind of want to see what else there is, so I'm just going to keep riding and see what I can find. Okay, so the drain keeps going, which means I'm going to keep going, see what else I can find. Someone's gone full office space on this printer. Okay, that tunnel up ahead seems to be an actual tunnel rather than just a bridge or going from one place to another like the previous one which went under the highway. So I'm going to go up and have a look at that. I don't know if going in is a good idea but see what happens when I get there. So I'm just inside the mouth of the tunnel. As you can see, it splits off into three. We have a big tunnel, kind of like the ones I've been riding along, just getting under the bridges and stuff. And then you have two little ones heading off, curving around a corner, so I can't really see where they go. 
I'm kind of intrigued to see where all of them go. So I might just go off for an explore and see where I end up. It doesn't look that dangerous. There's not much water and if the water rises at all, I'll get straight out. Right, so that one just keeps heading off into the distance as far as I've seen. It's not very comfortable to walk in because I'm kind of having to straddle. <laughs> straddle the water to actually get anywhere. So I'm gonna head back, head into the bigger tunnel and see what happens. probably a few hundred meters in. There's nothing that's giving me any cause for alarm, so I think I'm just gonna keep going in. I'm not quite sure what I'm worried about seeing. A wall of water would be pretty horrible, but like meeting other people probably wouldn't be great. Yeah, I'm not actually sure. I'll just keep going and see what I can see. As you can see, my bike lights don't put out a lot of light, so I've got extra torches with me. Maybe it's time to get some new bike lights. So it sounds kind of amazing in here. You've got the distant, distant sound of traffic coming from off down the, there. We've gone around the corner, so I can't see anything. We're probably 500 meters a, a K in. I've got no idea. Up this end, you've got a kind of waterfall-y thing. So there's just all this amazing sound. So I might just put the camera down and capture some of that and shut up for a bit. There's actually light there, so that goes up to the street. I just saw someone walk across it, which was kind of weird. I might stick my phone up, see if I can work out where we are. Okay, I'm not sure what to do from here. The tunnel just seems to keep on going. But I've left my bike back a few hundred meters because I couldn't bring it up here without carrying it the whole way. So I might just get to the next corner and see what I can see and then potentially head back. I don't think there's much more to see along here. There's just so many noises down here. There's the noises filtering through from the manhole cover there's the waterfall up there and every time I hear one I think someone else has joined me in the tunnel but then I point my torch down and no one has. It is kind of weird and creepy. Right, I'm going to get on my bike and right out of here been fun exploring but I don't think I'm gonna see anything else beyond concrete tunnels with graffiti on them through from here on in and the further I get in the more trouble it could be if something happened so thank you heaps for watching this let me know if you got any questions 
and otherwise I'll see you in the next video. See ya.